welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I am going to just do this quick little video. I'm gonna make some tacos and I made them the other night and they were so freaking delicious that I had to show you guys. What I mean, they're super simple and it's not that big of a deal, but they're delicious and you should make them. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna start with. This is everything I'm using. Um, I'm gonna do it step by step so you guys can see. So I'm gonna use these tortillas. These are sprouted corn tortillas. I got these from Whole Foods uh, in the freezer section. They were cold or frozen. Um, and they're honestly my new favorites. These are so good. And then I have avocados. I'm gonna make guacamole. I'm also gonna have um, some cut up uh, vine, grapevine, what? Vine tomatoes and put that in the, I'll show you guys step by step everything, how I do everything. Um, okay, so I'm gonna use cod. I like this and my husband likes the shrimp, so I'm gonna do both. I'm gonna make this for me to put in my tacos and then I'm gonna make shrimp for him. Um, I'm also gonna add mango salsa and cilantro. So the so what will be in the taco is the meat or the fish, the salsa, the guac, and the cilantro. It's super simple, but it is literally my new favorite thing. So here I go, I'll show you how I do it. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with the guacamole. This is my favorite guacamole. This is my favorite dish to make guacamole in. Okay, so I'm gonna just use, how many should I use? I think I'm gonna use two avocados, so I'm gonna get one more. Okay, so how I make my guacamole, and I would like to say that my guacamole is absolutely fucking delicious. Two avocados, what am I gonna add? I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add tomatoes. I'm gonna just uh, cut up a few and put them in there. Gar Normally I have garlic salt, regular garlic salt, and I add that, but I don't have any right now, so I'm just gonna add garlic powder and Himalayan pink salt. And then normally I add like a little bit of cilantro to it, but I'm gonna already, I'm just gonna put cilantro on top of the tacos. So I'm not, I, you don't want it too much cilantro. So I chopped up tomatoes, put the tomatoes in with the avocado. I put in some salt and garlic powder, and now I'm just going to mash everything up and make, that'll be my guac. By the way, look at that. Check those babies out. Okay, I'm gonna put this back in the fridge because I like my stuff cold. And um, now I'm going to get started on the fish and the shrimp. And then I will also do the, the tortillas simultaneously with the fish. Okay, so I have all my pans. I'm gonna be cooking the fish, shrimp, and one tortilla at a time because that's all I can do. And Curtis will probably have three tortillas. I'll probably have two. And so I'm gonna turn all of these bad boys on just to like medium heat. Okay, so I'm just going to flip those in about a, two minutes. Um, I'm just gonna keep uh, cooking more tortillas till I get to the number I need. Gonna stir these, wait till these are done. So basically I'm just cooking everything till it's done. Then we are ready to eat. Okay, so the meat is done. I like it nice and shredded. So that's done, turn that skillet off. I'm just waiting for the tortillas right now and I still have to do one more. So I pretty much just used all of the white fish that I made and um, I would say after being cooked, it's about, I don't know, five or six ounces. I'm just gonna guesstimate in my macros. Um, yes, I'm still counting macros, but I like intuitively track macros. Like I add up everything I eat and I log it all. And um, it really helps me to see if I'm under eating and then I know, oh shit, I gotta get more food in. Or, oop, I need to stop there, I don't wanna overeat because I just kinda um, go off what my body needs each day. And you know what, I'm doing that and it's really working for me. Back to this. All right, so I put my fish on and then I'm just going to guesstimate. I just don't feel like weighing right now because I just wanna get this video done. But normally I would weigh and I'm hungry, I'm starving and I just wanna eat. It's not an excuse, people, weigh your shit. I'm gonna guesstimate that is about, I'm just gonna say 40 or 50 grams of avocado, probably 50. And then I'm gonna have, I'm gonna guesstimate about two tablespoons of uh, mango salsa. This is my favorite. Then I'm just gonna put a couple sprinkles of cilantro on top. This is so simple uh, yet so delicious, you guys. So we got the white cod, the guacamole with garlic powder, Himalayan pink salt and uh, tomatoes, and then you're gonna have, and then I have the uh, mango salsa and cilantro. Simple, so good. All right, so that's it. 
I'm gonna go eat those, I'm really hungry. I also filmed a vid a, another YouTube video the other day of me doing, um, what was it? I think it was a back workout. So I'm gonna attach that to this video so you guys can have that. There's a full workout for you. Take it to the gym, enjoy it. Tag me in your pics on Instagram um, if you do my workouts and you film them and you put them up put them up um, I would love to see you guys doing my workouts so sorry I haven't been um, very good about getting I was on a roll with YouTube videos and then I'm so busy trying to get this nine-week challenge out you guys that um, I just haven't gotten a lot of it I'm doing like I'm back to one a week and when I was like up to three a week so I'm gonna try and get back on that as soon as my challenges are done um, or whenever I have time my challenges should be out in September and then I will have much more time to free up to devote to YouTube. So I'm really, really excited for that. I'm super excited for these challenges, you guys. I'm so excited for you guys to see. Signups um, start Monday. That's probably when this video will be posted. And uh, the 1st of August. So signups will be about four to five-ish weeks. And they will start in the second week, I believe, of September. And there's gonna be a huge prize at the end. I'm gonna fly someone out to Miami to hang out with me. I'm gonna put you up. Um, we're gonna work out, we're gonna go to dinner, I'm gonna show you around, and it's gonna be so much fun. So there's also gonna be second and third prizes too. So I'm really, really, the more you guys support these challenges, the bigger they're gonna get, the bigger they're gonna get, the, the, the bigger the prize is, um, and it's just gonna be amazing. And there's a lot that's going into these challenges, you guys. Not just, you're not just gonna transform in these nine weeks physically, but you're also gonna transform mentally, and you're gonna have a whole mental conditioning workbook um, you're gonna have everything that, that you're gonna have basically 20 chapters almost of, of everything I did to change my life and become the person I am today and to become successful and to change your mindset and it's like a workbook and oh my god there's so much I put into it you guys so I'm really really excited for this tell your friends and I really hope uh, you guys go sign up thank you guys so much for the support Please like this video, share with a friend if it helped. What's up, babes? I am on my way to get a workout in. I'm gonna try and film for you guys if it's not too busy. I'm gonna get some back buys and tries in today. Um, I always give you guys a lot of lower body, uh, booty leg workouts, hamstring workouts, but um, I've had some requests to get more workouts and more body parts and stuff. I am gonna show you guys an upper body workout today, so that should be fun. Um, there's been like a big group of people in my apartment gym every single day they're from like switzerland or something and they're like aspiring personal trainers and they just they're like in this huge group and they just stand around it's really really annoying and frustrating because you're trying to use equipment and get and get your workout done and these people will not get out of the way one of these in my gym bag so this came with like a set a resistance band set but I just took this one took the handles off and I just always keep this in my gym bag I do I use it to warm up my upper body like this I use it to do a uh, band pull aparts for your rear delts in between sets these bands just this simple band just carry this in your uh, gym bag it has a lot of uses I even do like I even warm up my hamstrings on hamstring day or leg day on it. Things like that. Just to warm them up. So this band has a lot of different uses and I recommend you you also carrying one in there. But for now I'm just gonna warm up and then I'm gonna start my back workout.
stretch through here and pull through here. Keep your arms at your sides and don't let don't let this move. Keep these right here like this. cardio for today. I've already done my four steady state cardio sessions for this week, so um, just to burn extra calories. I don't burn that much on my upper body days. Honestly, I've burned 150 calories throughout all those supersets. I'm just not a quick calorie burner. Um, so I'm going to take 15 pound dumbbells. I'm going to take 15 pound dumbbells and do a circuit. And it's going to be squat press, push up to plank, renegade rows, and then mountain climbers. Those four things, I'm going to do them back to back with no rest, only one minute rest after each sequence and then I'm going to repeat it five to six times and that's going to act as my cardio and also build muscle at the same time. This is a great way to get your cardio in. This is called HIT, and it takes less time. You burn more calories and uh, you burn more calories after, hours after your workout because of the HIT. and um, if you're not feeling like getting on a steady state cardio machine then this is a great alternative. So here I go. It's a killer. And then go again. And I did about 10 reps of each of everything. 10 reps press, 10 reps of each arm renegade rows, 10 each way plank push ups, and then 10 mountain climbers, 20 altogether. So repeat that five to six times, one minute rest after each sequence. All right, I'm gonna finish this cardio sesh. Hope you enjoyed the workout, and I'll talk to you guys soon.